Let's just get this goddamn over with. Okay. Oh, hey, under the traffic lights, four plus edition. Cause goddamn four plus was just so damn good to me last year. I can't wait to do this episode tonight. Out doing the DoorDash thing. Koya's Cafe. There's like two fucking tables in there. Was it really? Yeah. What a fucking joke. And then we went to that Indian cafe. And yeah. I know this was shocking. I was probably the only non-Indian. <laughs> but we out making the rounds. We're somewhere on the Milan Belt. Wait, oh, there's Ivy. We're going to talk four plus today. How you feeling, Coco? We're almost there. One Good. more day till opening day. Woohoo! I'm excited to watch Blake. Yeah. Bring that shovel if need be. We're getting there, you know. It so. is supposed to be gross again tomorrow. Is it? Mm -hmm. With my hockey skill or the weather? <laughs> the weather. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I we can't ain't... tell if that's the sun. Sorry, guys. Holy fuck. What are you doing? I didn't know if it was the sun or if my camera was cloudy. I think it was my camera. Jesus Christ. All right. Well, Big voice guy, I got a new one. You want to do big voice guy? I can. Do Let's I have get... to change my voice? Yes, the big voice. Since the haters are out and about, but that ain't gonna stop me. Not today. <laughs> Not fucking today. I gotta make a new voices. Lay it on me. Last playoffs, the Yetis exiting a sh what? <laughs> can you fucking read? <laughs> I can't read your handwriting. <laughs> what does that say? Yeah, he's exiting. You don't even know what you wrote. <laughs> Hold on. Extinguished. That's Start from the top. Extinguished. Start from the fucking top and give the people the respect. Now I just spit all over. I'm so upset. Take two. <laughs> Last playoffs, the Yetis extinguished the Tri City Fire to claim the cup. Will the Yetis rungy up another cup or will they fall Schultz of their goal? Oh, nice. I love my fucking dad jokes. <laughs> Great really job. Good at dad jokes. Great fucking job. Did you pause this? No, it's oh, gone. Okay. I'm taking orders. I'm making money tonight. Okay. Making money. <laughs> <laughs> so you're right getting the four plus rosters, like I said, yeah. yeah. Wait, what did I say? Oh, yeah, the Yetis did win that division. Yeah, yeah. it was all Tri City Fire. They extinguished yeah. Tri City Fire. Yeah, yeah boy. Okay. All right, Is let's get the rosters. Yeah, with? let's start from the top. Yetis. We got four plus Yetis. We got Hoagie, Michael Hoag, uh -huh. Josh Schlemmy, yeah. Chris Rungi, oh. Gomi, Ryan Gomez, yeah. Jake Schultz, Matt Bowie, Jordan Esco, Phil Bittner, Wyatt Price, and in goal. Taylor Davis. Yeah, what do you think of that? Um, TV and with the Yetis. I think that's we all, a good combo. I someone think. said they saw it coming, you know, summer journey last year. He did it for him. And who wouldn't want Taylor Davis? I'll always be a Taylor Davis guy. Yeah. He's until a sweet I die. Guy. <laughs> well, he's not, not only a sweet guy, he's a great goalie. He is, yeah. Jesus Christ, can we get back to Quad Cities and get some fucking orders? Holy fuck. <laughs> I'm going to end up in Milan. There's a lot of underrated. Uh, you know, Schlemmy's a great defender, plays well. Esco does, you know, not including them. I think out stars. of this entire roster, Schlemmy's probably the only one I couldn't point out in a crowd. Okay. I think he's the only one I don't really know. How about the, I don't want to say, the, you know, they got Chris Runge and Ryan Gomez. They were on Anarchy last year, so those are two big pickups for them. Mm-hmm. Yep, I think the world of both of those guys. So. Yeah, that's a really good roster. I know, I know. We find that shocking with the Yetis, right? Right. All right. <laughs> All right. What's next? All right. Next we have Anarchy. Oh, okay. Well, we'll see what they reloaded with. All right. We have Alex Thede. Austin. Holy fuck! Go. So I get in the other lane. Oh, God. Sorry. Alex Thede. Austin Rosebro. Oh, uh, Rosie. Ethan Quinn. Joe Timson. Cody Harkey, Joe Timpson again, good lord. Cody plays, Harkey. Joe Timpson plays how much, dude, he's nuts. Yeah, like you used to be. Probably no, are. Not nuts. Nate Corey, Grayer Pruitt, Xander Boatman, Dalton Hegebo, and the goalie is Mark Corey. Alrighty. Uh, that one that, where, what are you doing? I'm going to go out the beltway. Okay. Rose, 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 a hell of a pickup. He's only got one move, but he's 
still scores with that move. He's so He's got good. the little ice move. Yeah, I know, but he's damn good. He's Obviously, he's going to get better and better. Yeah. How many Quins are there? Uh, a lot. Is there? Yeah. Mac and Ethan? Who yeah. else? Yeah. Uh, Liam. Liam, yeah. Liam's damn good, too. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Good team. They reloaded. Was Xander Boatman on that team? Yeah. I love me some Xander Boatman. When he's hot, he's hot. Like, that scoring is instant. He's a kid, too, right? Yeah. Okay, I yeah. thought so. Yep. His dad's great dad. Good. Um, okay, we have Deck and Balls. Uh-oh. Is this a remake of, like, the uh, team that Dylan used to be I on? don't think they're aware there was a summer tourney team. There used to be balls. a team called Deck and Balls for Summer Tournament. Right. Were you one or just Dylan? No. Just Dylan. I, yeah. no. I got higher stairs of playing a <laughs> Deck and Balls team. Huh. All right, on deck and balls, we have Cam Overton, Hayden Musser, Gage Doppler, mm -hmm. Cooper Carroll, Brecken Miller, Max Patton, right? Yeah. Okay. Landon Delaska. Yeah. Texas Mud. Yeah, well, if his last name is Mud, you're doing fine. Texas Mud. That is a cool name. I like that. Trenton Walden, and the goalie is the one and only Colton Nelson. Oh, that's interesting. So, a lot of these kids, I'm going to say former Blues players, are still playing with the Blues. Not former, they're at the age where they can or play even Jimmy. Yeah, Mud, Patton, Colton's obviously a stud goalie. Yeah. Landon Delaska could definitely play the game. I think he took last year off. Is Colton the oldest kid on this roster? Oh, definitely. Roster? <laughs> definitely. <laughs> nice. Yeah. yeah, man, they'll be able to run and they'll be skilled. Come good team. Texas Mud, you now win my little prize for the coolest name. It was Congrats. Ryan Pillow, but Congrats. now it's Texas Mud. What about Ben Quick? That, I mean, that was kind of like your guys thing. Okay. I like Texas Mud. You like Texas Mud and you like saying bad things about Savage. I didn't say <laughs> anything about Savage. Right. God. What's the next team? Oh. Let's nail this fucking in. Mighty Dex. Oh, the champs yep. from D4 are moved up. Nice. Okay, we have Zach Tucker, Matt Monty, Colin Mannion, Peyton Bazzari again. Peyton, you are busy. Peyton's a busy guy. Uh, Kyle Chandler. Blur. Okay. Uh, Noah Segrin, Brenton Stroops, TJ Finch, Eric Lucan, and in goal we have Josh Becht. Honestly, Josh Becht's just amazing. Last year, you know, he won that cup and sky's yeah. the limit. I think my only issue too. is he's playing on like five teams. That's crazy. Yeah. So come playoff time, who knows? Yeah. You know, you could be do, playing three, four in a night even. So hell of a team. A hell of a team. Peyton and Brenton and TJ built good teams. Yeah. Oh, good. Let me fucking look at that. Oh, sorry. This is the next oh, one. Oh, okay. That's why I was going back. Well, yeah. Solid team is always mighty Dex and it's cool. Then yeah. So I don't know. Hell of a team. Okay, Dominoes. Paul Hart, Cole yeah. Brown, Jason Specht, Jeff Koenig, Josh Schick, Scott O'Sell, Connor Smith. Smitty's back, yeah. And Former the, Bandit. Nice. And then yeah. the goalie is Brandon Evans. Well, obviously, you know, Brandon Evans wanted to play a little lower league, too. Play on more than one team, and obviously, like Chef said the other night, he's been incredible last year. He really picked it up. Yeah, I'm is, glad yeah. to see Connor Connor Smitty back. Uh, great shot, plays great defense. Good kid. Um, Jeff Koenig obviously can out run anybody. He's got he can de out DQ. Yeah, Cole Brown of course. So. Wasn't Cole in like a D two plus or something roster that we read? Probably three plus. He yeah. usually plays me and me. Okay. I think there's still you need two or three players. So hey boys, hey I'd reach out to Dylan Idol if I were you, but that's just me. Yeah, definitely. Dylan's still looking for a team. Yeah. yeah. He's a good player. Definitely. Yeah. So. And his hips all healed, so he's good to go. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah. Uh, okay. Misfits. Uh, we Dale have, Dick team. Yep. We have Travis Sample. Is that kind of like Ben Quick? <laughs> Travis Sample, John Doe. <laughs> uh, uh, sample this bitch after he scores or something. <laughs> oh, my God. Where gosh. are the fucking orders? They got dark ever since. Saturday night. Holy fuck. All right, go ahead. You're just entering the red. So. Oh, well, whoop-de-doo. Mm. All right. All right. Travis Sample. 
Mm -hmm. Warren Kai Huey. Uh huh. Jersey Mike's. All right, I gotta make a turn. <laughs> Go ahead. All I'm right. sorry. So Warren Kaihui, I still don't know if I'm saying your name right. You never told me. He just got what married, married? and yeah. had a kid. Congrats, yeah. Warren. Uh, Shelton Davis, Sean Waterloo Mc guy. Oh, okay. Sean McGilligan. Yeah. Logan McGilligan. Yeah. What are we yawning? Kyle Newberry, David Rowett, Blake Markey. Oh. Andrew Collins, and then Gold, Dale Dick. So a few uh, Tri-City guys fire from last year. Rowat's a good player. Marky is a uh, lot of Waterloo talent on that team. Dale did a good job at building this team. Mm -hmm. I really That's like this one. lineup. I'm glad he got a couple of Waterloo guys. So they're not just all Waterloo guys on one team. Yeah. It's nice to see them kind of like dispersed yeah. a little bit. Oh yeah, and those guys, they'll play with anybody. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is there any more? No, that was it. How many teams were there? Seven? Six, One, seven? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Yeah, of course, Bender's dropped. Thank the fuck God. <laughs> that was miserable. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I, I've never Bender been, a playoff, I've never been a playoff game where both teams <laughs> wanted to lose when we played Thunder Clocks. <laughs> if we won and I was almost disgusted by that because they got eliminated and got to go home. Yeah, and you wanted to just yeah, be done. Be done, yeah. But mm -hmm. play for the love of the game, they tell me. <laughs> so let's yeah. go through our guests and you can kind of tell me what you learned this week with each of our guests. So Monday night, right, we started Justin Leatherman. Yes. Um. Does it have to be hockey related? No. I learned that Justin Leatherman can cook. And he cooks for his family. I was impressed by that. And it was pretty good. Um, and also I made a couple of new cute friends. His little girls, Sophia and Ava. Adorable. If you hear noise on the front end that of this video, it's totally normal with a car. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, I mean just I've gotten known for a while. I just respect the hell out of him. Yeah, he's you know, such a nice guy. He's laid back, but he plays at a competitive level. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah, very yeah, respectful guy. I've never heard him say anything mean about anybody, I don't think. All right. So. All right, well, push this boot on our bitch on pause here. I gotta well, go. We don't pause. Oh, then. Well, then we'll be back. Elaborate. You restarted it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. We don't have pause. I don't think. <laughs> yeah. We do. I don't know how. Uh, I'm on my way, Fallon from Jersey Mike's. Jersey Mike's good shit. That is really good. We don't have it often. Getting enough. the big kahuna. Have you ever got the big kahuna? Nope. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so then Tuesday we had Mr. Uh, oh, I can't even turn you here. Can't turn left. Holy fuck. But we had Devin Alby again with us, our usual cast and mm -hmm. former podcast on the podcast side. What'd you learn from Mr. Alby this freaking time? I guess I didn't. I mean, I knew Chev always liked wrestling, but I didn't realize that he actually like coached the little kids. Mm. What do you say, fourth to eighth grade? Yeah. Yeah. So that was kind of cool. I mean, I think he'd be really good for that job. He's fun. I don't know if you saw his last Facebook post like a week or two ago. Like, I used to get into Facebook much, but it was awesome. Like, like talking about, you know, we all have our own issues and stuff. Yes, and it's I okay to that. ask. And he got quite a bit of a response. And, yeah. Man, the guy's right. Need to be more For a guy being tough as nails, he's right on the money, man. Mm -hmm. So, I, I love Dev. Of course, Jack to play with him. and I don't know what else I can say, so. Yeah. He's Great to have guy. him on. I appreciate him coming on. He had a wrestling banquet that night and still rushed over to came over on, like, someone else that stood us up. <clears throat> Zach Mickle, right? right, or something. I don't know. He's all, It's like he's almost mad at me because I tore him apart in the playoff vlog last year. I forgot about that. <laughs> it's almost like he got that bag. I'm just, nah, I'm just kidding. Zach's a good guy, too. Three. Zach's a great guy. We'll have him on sometime for sure. Yeah, he said next time. Yeah. So. I'll ask tomorrow. No, sure. <laughs> uh, then, uh, who the fuck did we see next John after that? Road, Bowie. Matt Bowie, yes, of course, my new teammate. Yeah, what'd you, what'd you think of Matt? He brought you some drinks. He did, yes. Matt got on my good side with the uh, mm -hmm. seltzers. 
Yeah. Am I supposed to turn? No, I'm supposed to turn right. Left. Yeah, left. Yes. Yeah, I am right. <laughs> What'd you say? Uh, I said Matt got on my good side. Brought yeah. me some seltzers. Right. Yeah. That was very kind of him. I didn't know he was going to. Yeah. Yeah, looking so. forward to playing with him. Hopefully mm -hmm. golfing again. I don't know if people know. He's an incredible golfer. Is he really? Yeah. Did he go with you and Johnny? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he was the, he was the best one by far. So. Hmm. Yeah. All right, yeah, looking forward to it. Uh, I think cool. he's got three games tomorrow night. So. Three? Yeah, God bless you. Wow. And then... Oh, we went over to... Made the mistake of going to Tim's Corner Comics like usual. <laughs> What'd you think of Mr. Phil? The baby hater? Mm-hmm. Only one, Joe Amstutz baby hater. That's true. Yeah. Yes. So that's okay. That means there's millions of babies he does like. But he... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fun. Phil's a nice guy. He is. Funny as usual, I thought. Yeah. There's just some stuff like he says that makes you like, oh my God. Where'd you come up with this stuff? Uh, what'd you think of... <laughs> this is your first time eating Horny Greg. Yeah. He was a nice guy, too. Yeah, yeah. he's a great guy. I've really just got but to know him. But it's funny because with us, he was so quiet. Yeah. Like, for the most part. I mean, he spoke up, obviously. But like quiet and, like, theory? respectable and all that. And then they were saying when he gets out on the deck, he's just, like, total trash talker. Yeah. And he doesn't seem like he would be that at all. Yeah. I thought that was funny. Theory? I wonder what makes him horny. I forgot to ask. No, don't, you were there for that conversation. There's a wrestler whose name is Horny Greg. Oh. And Phil has the screenshot of the rest the sports card, whatever you call those, yeah. on his phone, and it describes Horny Greg. Um, I will read it or will give my interpretation on this because it's kind of a family site. But yeah, somehow I don't know they correlated the two of them so it has to do with the wrestler gotcha. and of course uh jared jared said out yep always my buddy so i don't know why he picked on me with the whole savage thing i don't get it maybe he just missed sunder uh, misheard it happens happens uh, to the best of them yeah and i still love you jared and mr lee yep always a great guy they're going on a cruise next month yes yeah. They're going to Disney, and then they're going on a Disney cruise. I am yeah. jealous. Yeah, I mean, yeah, there's nothing. Anybody that's met Lee or Jared, they're salt of the earth people, without yeah. a doubt. And yeah. I just, I just love them both to death. So. He's another one of the. They're both. Well, not so much Jared. I don't think. Maybe I don't know. I just, I always thought that they were mean guys. Like way back when. Well, you know, we used to have a rivalry really back then. Yeah, because they always used to win and their kids would run around with the big devil's flags and oh my god, I used to get so mad. And now I have like, the kids are awesome, those yeah. two are awesome, their wives are awesome. So. Maybe you'll even find a yeti or two that's okay ish. Well, that, we'll see. <laughs> I mean, you're a yeti and I love you, so. Okay. We'll see about the rest of them. Uh, and Matt brought me seltzers, so he's okay too. Yeah, you mentioned that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to certainly miss Lee if he's retired, if he's really done for good, which is, kind of sounds like at least for now he is. So. Yeah, he said at least a year or two. Yeah, so. so. Going to focus on the family. If so, he went on top, and mm -hmm. I've never respected someone more playing against him, too, man. Always had some battles back in the day. Mm -hmm. so. And then we had Josh Howman yesterday, right? That was our yep. last guest. Yep. You kind of know Josh as your coach and stuff, your team. Uh-huh. What'd you think? Yeah, that was fun. Invite him, him back. <laughs> no, I would. I mean, yeah. He brought a, you some shit. Huh? He brought you some stuff, didn't he? Or just me? Uh oh, he brought me my jersey. Oh, that was it. Yeah, you're the only one that got goodies. Thank like. you for the goodies, Mr. Hyman. Not Brent Goodmanson. He didn't bring Brent Goodmanson. Candy and stuff. <laughs> Red Hots and white chocolate Reese's. Your favorites. Yeah. So I appreciate all of our guests. We still have, uh, yeah, yeah, or, yeah. I better say something nice about Josh. I forget. Yeah, he's a he's a really stand up guy. I love talking to him. He doesn't take it seriously, you know. Yeah, and I'd forgotten he was so into softball. Yeah, so yeah. That was kind of interesting. So you know he's damn good. And yeah, he's great on the deck. <clears throat> mm -hmm. so. Yeah, he is. Yeah, great, great shot. He can snipe. 
all day. So I appreciate all of our guests. You know, we actually had a couple that wanted on we couldn't even get on. So yeah, so yeah, summer tournament. We can get those on. Yeah, there. yeah, for sure. Because that's well, we still got our women's show here. We're gonna yep. do in a couple we're days. Film that Monday. Yeah, so. that'll be fun. Yeah, so. That's it, I guess, for uh, the old under the traffic lights. I hope for our good. Thank you, Rock, for that post game analysis of that big preseason game. Yes. Between the Firestorm and the Sheen Bikers. Interesting. The Rocket is back. D6 is in fucking trouble. You can. You heard it from me second because you're from Rocket first. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you got anything else? Um, where. Since we're talking about Rocket, where did he get his figurines of himself from? He told you, if you listen to it, like everybody else, he got it from Zach Starry. His friend made it for him. Oh, okay. So not, okay. No, not a reputable okay. company <laughs> we got from a friend. Okay. Go. Yep, green. Yeah, boy. Let's go. <laughs> this guy's got his big kahuna. Probably watching basketball or something. Probably. Yeah. We should probably go do that, too. All right. Well, that's it. For under the traffic lights, I appreciate you hanging with us. This is, of course, a long week covering all the divisions. We're looking forward to Monday to talking to a very special guest. Yeah. And That's then we'll that. be, well, ready to play before then. So, yeah, so we'll see you all out there tomorrow, huh? Yep. All right. Good luck to everybody tomorrow on your first game. Hope no, it's no. Warm. Everybody no. except for the, uh, the other guys. Other guys, yeah. I hope they blow. <laughs> Personally, I, I know that I think Brooke has her first game tomorrow, and Lindsay Schmidt has her first game tomorrow, and Terry has her first game tomorrow. So, a lot of that's great. Teammates. We'll talk women's on Monday. That's great. For well, I'm players. just saying, who's okay? Do you want to go down the whole fucking lineup who's playing tomorrow? I was just saying who my team is. Like, it's not fucking Robert Room. Was... Mark's here. Brendan's here. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. All right, well, there we go. All right, I'll take you eight, also. You wanna go to eight, also? Sure. Somewhere nice. You can always win my heart over with Mexican. Yeah, I know. Yeah. All right, <laughs> that's it. Under the traffic lights. Thank you. See ya.